The Athena deal, as you guys know, we followed somewhat closely, although at the end there, it was just enough. But we did get it. Um, 160 is where Elliot started, if you guys recall, but that was prior to actually being able to do real due diligence. 135 is where they end up, although uh, from everybody close to this, Elliot paid, played what I'm told was a very constructive role in getting to the finish line here and getting something done. They will continue to be a minority holder. Veritas putting the business together with an old GE business, a GE healthcare business that they bought not that long uh, back, guys, kind of interesting. Um, and, you know, the idea is to make this into a vertical uh, software as a service company, sort of transition to it, not something necessarily that you would have been able to do particularly well in the public markets. We've watched the last two quarters from Athena while this has played out. They have not been good quarters, uh, including the one that was just reported Friday night. Uh, so I think there is relief on the part of uh, the company and to a certain extent its shareholders that they were able to get this to the finish line. You know, the opportunity, Jim, is still there to mine and monetize so much of that robust data set that they have in healthcare, but they haven't yet really been able to do it. 